Welcome to Mail Call. This month, Matt bought some guns. We're going to look at them. First of all, we should look at the best first. That puts me on the spot. I just Thanks said that to see which one he would pick. Cabot. Cabot? Well, you got Taren and you got Cabot. They're both best and they're both their own categories. Can I Depends pick? Depends which category you're speaking of. Cool, 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 cool. So which one? Which category? You didn't give categories. You just well, said I know. Well, well, as far as high quality build, you know, something that you wouldn't shoot every day. Cabot. That's just because you won't shoot it every day. Me, personally, yes. But this Taren. is Taryn. Let's do it last those. since everything else is on top of it. So this one first. <laughs> of course we will. <laughs> Cabot. Now, I like the blue, and the wife really likes this one because it's blue, matches her eyes, and she's in, she likes gold, as you well know. It's really hard not to sing Baby Blue by George Strait right now. Don't sing it. Don't sing. We don't need that. I mean, very serious. What a great looking gun. It's got a lot of gold. As you mentioned, there's blue too. Yeah. My eyes go to the gold first. Why is that? Um, because it's gold. Because it's gold. There's no like diamond in the side or anything, so. That's whatever. okay. It's got your, your grip safety in the back. I shot this, I was the first one to shoot it. Yep, I gave you the honors. It was kind of crazy. It was pretty cool to be the first one to shoot it. This is a 45, so it kicked a good amount. This one doesn't have like any ported barrel or. It's for looks, comp. I think. It's, yeah, it's a looks. It's a sexy gun. It's a looks gun. Cabot of the month. How exciting. Yep, and there's more coming. A lot more coming. That's why we're going to... One every month. One every month. And we might even add on another room just for Cabot's. Who knows? We're going to add to the house. We'll do a whole build out. Yeah. Run out of room, folks. Need more room. Might demo a wall with a shotgun. That'd be kind of fun. That would be fun to demo a whole house with a shotgun. Yeah. Or ten, right? That's just explosions. That's just... Like, yeah, they won't do anything. Yeah, Demo. Yeah, that's demo. Good point. So, yes, great gun. Shoots fantastic, as you will have said. The wife hasn't shot it, and she will not. It's I won't 45. let her shoot. It's, it's a big one. It's a big one. And she's not a big fan of 45s. Right. So, but she likes big things in her hands, but just not really 45s. Back to the gun. <laughs> so, that's uh, that's pretty, really beautiful gun. Cabot guns. Really, I like, heavy. It. I mean, one single piece of steel that they carved this out of, that kind of deal. What's it called? This is the Icon, Icon Royale. Royale. Matt, read that for us. You want me to read that? Yeah. I kind of hate you right now. <laughs> I can't read it. It's too small of a print. Your glasses are on your hat. Yeah, but they're dirty and I can't read that. I'll read it. A regal version of our Icon 1911 featuring minimalist design cues. Remove all that is not necessary and what you have left is a masterpiece. While our August pistol is an engineered precise tool, precision tool, the Icon Royale has been elevated from our 2023 GOTM Gun of the Month collection for high artistic value with the art of finishing. Our prized Cabot blue and contrasting gold concepts and accents provide for stunning visual intensity, suitable for a monarch, enthusiast, or a captain of industry. The Icon Royale is a unique pistol worthy of the addition to any arsenal of any collector. Meticulously transformed from block stainless steel, the Icon Royale embodies the past, present, and future of the 1911, all in one stunning gun. Each pistol is masterfully constructed and displays our stunning precision machining of components and the art of hand-finished details. The imagination is the only limit possible. Chambered in 45 ACP and crafted in a commander size format. Robert A. Biancan. Yeah, so like I said, one single block of steel. They, they it feels like it. Turned it into a gun. It's a heavy gun. It's a heavy gun. It's, 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 it's good because it's 45 and you want I like reading it because they talked about how they literally took away everything that you don't need and just made a gun. Yep. Good job. What's next? The Raging Hunter. Yes. Who makes that? Taurus. Taurus, the Raging Hunter from Taurus. A good friend, David Holland, sent this out to the collector. Mm -hmm. David's a good dude. Very good, good dude. Has a battle with dude. cancer right now that he's fighting. So go click the link down below and give him a donation to help fight, fight that cancer. Love you, sure. David. Love you, Dave, for sure. But it's a big bore gun, 44 mag. I like big bore guns. I just have that problem. Small guy, big gun issue. What, what does that mean, big bore? Big bore, big caliber. Sorry, big I don't bore. know people. Yeah, just big caliber. Big caliber. Yeah. What's a bore? Is that the barrel? Yes. Yeah, that's why it's a big bore. Got it. Big bore. I kind of dig the gun. We talked about this what last shot show. Yeah. We saw him at yeah, shot it's show. been a minute. Yeah. yeah we saw him at shot show, and I said, I don't have this. You were like dual wielding him in the yeah. booth. We got yeah. that picture. Yeah, it was a badass mm -hmm. picture. We gotta give a shout out to Ruben as well. 
Hi, Ruben. Yeah, we shot it. You and I both did. Yeah, yesterday. It's a beast. As well, it's a beast. They uh, got it yeah, ported. Yeah, it's it's a beast. It's ported. They do a lot of videos of like people hunting big game with these guns, so that's kind of cool. Like hog hunting, even. And uh, I should and put my thermal on that. It's like my Desert Eagle. I'll be honest. It's like the but Desert Eagle. Gold. Like it's something that you, you just want on your gold. desk. One of these in gold would be cool for mm. you. I really like their two tone. They have like one that's like oh silver with, and black. Yeah, 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 yeah I've really seen like that one. their two tone. I've seen that one. It's badass. But really cool gun. It's a beast to shoot, for sure. Oh, yeah. uh, but uh, just fun to have on your hip on the 4th of July. <laughs> <clears throat> Next one. I finally got an Affinity, guys. Well, I had one before, but I didn't really show it off that much. But this one I have to show off because badass. Did you sell the other one? No, I still have it. You have an, you have an Infinity? Yes, yeah, right there. I thought this was the first Infinity. No. It's over there. It says Balls Deep 45 shit, or I can't remember what it was. It's from FN1 the, Firearm. <laughs> yeah, it was a, um, I don't know, custom serial number somebody did. But anyway, our boys at, what's the name of that gun store? Gallinson's, Gallinson's in Salt it. Lake City, Utah. Yep. The oldest gun store, the west side of the Mississippi, literally. It's the oldest FFL, western side of the Mississippi. I didn't know that. No. Tim at Gallinson's Guns, thank you for hooking Matt up with yep. this. Uh, if you guys are ever in Salt Lake City, go check it out because the, it's literally the coolest gun shop I've ever been. Been to. It cool. changes the art on the outside of the building constantly. It has really has artists come and do like whole wall murals. It's incredible. I need to go see them. Yeah. Anyway, this gun I might start collecting infinities now thanks to Tim. Honestly, you should. Infinities are pretty dope. It's got uh, you've got not stifling, but you've got grip that molds into the gun. I don't know how to describe it, but like there's stippling, kind of like a stippling, kind of like stippling, but has sandpaper sandpaper that goes inside of it. Whatever. It's got like a camo pattern on. That's what I really like. On about the it. slide. Yeah. Actually, it's all, all over the magwell as well. Yep. You get this closed or empty. And they've cut that off at an angle. Yeah. I don't know if it's it's got a purpose besides looks. It probably does, but it's really cool looking. I don't know that I've ever seen a gun that shaved that off like that. Uh, Have and you? That, no. no, no, no. Did you put this on or? I put that on. Okay. I, it was optics cut, so I added the SRO. Yep. But what blows my mind is the trigger. It's so light. You, you can blow on it and it goes off. Earn your life fire. That's a really light and crisp trigger. I remember yeah. Chad was uh, shooting this at the range yesterday. Yeah, and he said that was his new favorite like, or something like cow, that. like lightest trigger he's ever pulled. And it's pretty cool. It's like a flat trigger. You see that right there? It's a flat trigger and it is light. It is just like a, woo, woo. Yeah. Fun gun. Infinity makes great guns, obviously, but that's a really fun gun. Really fun to look at and hold and feel and, and play with. So. Yeah, that's going to be my new... I Infinity. think I'm going to start collecting Infinities. All right, Infinity, you heard him. Here he comes. Hide your kids. Hide your wife. <laughs> So this magnifier is a 3X. That means you're getting from a CQB situation to a much further distance shooting out, getting clearer vision, clear picture, very quickly. Show us how it's done, the collector. Aimpoint.us, go check it out. The Duty RDS and the 3XC. Badass. And now this is the, uh, you call it the TTI. Well, yeah. The Terran Tactical Innovations. Yep. Staccato. It's their Sorry. new combo commemorative set. There's guns and coins. Guns Can and I coins. grab the things? But that's, they... no, that's for the um, the markers. You know, they had to give their blood, put their blood on it. For that's John Wick? For fingerprint, yeah, for John this Wick. This is a John Wick thing too? Yeah, it's John Wick. Oh, cool. So these are John Wick things. So sort of, uh, yeah, this the... coin, this locket opens and you can put your blood in there and become an assassin. Yeah, it's an exclusive set. They only made 250 of them. Really? Yeah, only 250 of them. This is serial number combo four, serial number four guns. Gold coins. They cut underneath the padding, underneath here. I take the guns out, otherwise this thing has to get out. Oh. Yeah, this is the oh. island barrel one right here. Oh. This one's different. Island barrel, it's ported it up top and cut. Pretty close. Same, same size barrel. Probably a five inch barrel. Oh, so the bottom layer has the bloody pencil and yep. magazines Remember, for your guns. Yep. Now mm -hmm. the story on this, they debuted this NRA when we were there. Oh, okay. Remember we were at that booth when they big big the dinner. I do, yeah, it was a big so, thing. And after the unveiling, I told Taryn, I pulled him aside, I said, uh, so I'll take one, but 
what serial number do I get? So I don't know yet, and is what he gave me, which is fine. And I kept pushing for number two, but I didn't get number two. I ended up getting number four serial numbers. And I think number one, I think, went to the director maybe. Number I remember they promised you number three at the booth. It was two. It was two that they promised you? Yeah, but that's okay. I can deal with four. I'm good with that. I mean, I was lucky to get them anyway because they're practically all sold out, I bet. But the deal was that I'm assuming that the director got one. Keanu probably got a set. I'm sure Taron kept one for himself, obviously. For sure. But, yeah, it was pretty cool. Shout out to Taron for helping me out and getting this. Badass guns. I have not shot them yet. I mean, I have very similar guns to how many Combat Masters do I have now? 19 and no, 10? I don't, I don't have that many. 10. I'd say 10. Probably 10. 10 plus fair. everything in that plus safe. Plus everything in the John Wick safe. So Some of those are yeah. Combat Masters. But things. this is a badass set, guys. Look it up if you guys want to know the price of that thing. It was not cheap <laughs> whatsoever. But they're selling out. I've seen them online on gun stores right now selling them. Yeah. But they're high serial number guns. And a uh, really cool carrying case. They always send stuff in a cool case. All yeah. the John Wick stuff comes in cool cases. What's that? Rhino Metals makes them, I think. I can't remember who makes them. But anyways, cool case. Yeah, they're badass. Yeah. We'll be shooting these on another video and uh, letting you go how they, uh, these guns run. But they run great. So these you essentially bought at NRA. Yeah, we placed the order it in. We've been yeah. talking about the Raging Hunter since SHOT Show. Tor yeah. sent that out as a gift. And then the Infinity you got from Gallonson's, what, a month ago? couple weeks. Yeah, that's fair. That's fair. Right? And then the cabin of the month is just a monthly that comes all the time. Right. That was expected. Yep. So kind of a light month as far as gun count goes wise. I mean, we're at five guns. It's yeah. great. Yeah. It's great. What a lovely mail call. Um, and I believe we just had a delivery. I was getting buzzed on my phone. We just had a delivery come in. Of what? Mail now, call. we always get stuff coming in. But I never... I don't know. Sometimes they just come in and I got to call you. What would it be ordered and I don't know what they are. Yeah, I don't know what it is. So. <laughs> Okay, some goodies, 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 goodies from the gun cache. Shirt. Got a shirt. Um, I'll be real. I opened the thing and a mug fell and broke. Uh, we're gonna need another mug. Uh, sorry, but uh, gun cool cache shirt. sent out some shirts. Look at that hat. I like that. Flex, fit, sporty, cool. Just um, thousands of rounds of ammunition, which is what Matt shoots a lot of. Yes. So that's great. Thanks. Oh, yeah. Go thanks, check out guys. the gun cache. They sent ammo and lots of ammo i think they're gonna send it every month yeah 100 percent. all right cool let's go shoot some of the ammo then okay okay thanks for hanging with this episode of mail call yes um, thank with, you guys uh monotone johnny <laughs> do we like monotone johnny or do we like fun i didn't johnny? sing a song at all i almost did twice i'm kind of missing that but uh you know i'm just really inspirational i'm just here for you guys so i was really bored yeah, so if you're bored, tell us and say we want Fun Johnny back. If you don't want Fun Johnny back, then uh, I like Fun unsubscribe. Johnny. You guys are not around him 24-7. You guys would love it a lot more if you guys were around him with us 24-7. Aww. So there. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs>